Hi, I'm Dr. Stacia Hayes. I'm a board certified nurse practitioner specializing in pediatric primary care. So now that we're venturing out after more than a year of isolation and time away from in-person interactions, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention is predicting a significantly high flu activity this year. So what is the flu? Well, just simply put, it's a very contagious virus that affects your nose, your throat, and your lungs. And coupled with pneumonia, it's one of the top 10 leading causes of death in the United States. So many people want to know how to distinguish flu from COVID-19. Well, unfortunately, we really can't do that without a test because symptoms are often very similar. Flu symptoms really include rapid onset of fever, chills, headache, you might have a runny nose, and you might have body ache, and you might be really, really tired. Children also will have diarrhea and vomiting. So since some of these symptoms between the flu and COVID-19 are similar, if you do develop symptoms, your safest course of action is to get tested. If you do contract the flu, the best thing that you can do is take plenty of fluids and rest. Many people can be treated with prescription antiviral medications, and these are started within three days of having symptoms. However, these aren't for everybody. So if you are having symptoms, talk to your nurse practitioner or healthcare provider and ask if this medication is for you. We know that you wanna take steps to prevent others from getting the flu. And there's some easy things that you can do to prevent getting the flu and spreading the flu. Things like washing your hands frequently, not touching your face, and staying away from people who are sick. But the most important thing that you can do to protect yourself from the flu is to get your yearly flu vaccination. Hospitals are overcrowded with people being treated for COVID-19, but flu is really serious as well. The CDC says that last year alone, the flu vaccine prevented 7.5 million illnesses and over 105,000 hospitalizations. And do you know that last year, 20,000 people died from the flu and many of them were children. Illness from influenza is preventable and you can be part of the solution. So as an NP, I want you to run, not walk, to get your yearly flu vaccination. And if you have questions about the flu or any other part of your health care, reach out to a nurse practitioner. You can go to wechoosenps.org for more information. We want you to be healthy.